We bought the CDU Pro 737 from CP Flight because uh, I have here uh, on, on my left, this or on my right, sorry, this one. This is uh, a dummy, it's not real. This is the real thing. As you can see, it's a CDU 737, the normal one with a turn knob for the brightness. So I just received the uh, CDU. 737 Pro from CP Flight. Uh, we bought it at the Aviation Mega Store in uh, Aalsmeer, the Netherlands. And um, I want to test it and uh, first unpack it and uh, I want to show you what's inside. So please take a look. First, probably, this is the that's be, yeah, that's the power adapter, 12 volt plus in the middle, as described. Um, there's a cable, network cable, because it's the pro version, you don't need an extra screen. Uh, these are the DZUS screws. Um, Hopefully this is the CDU. Let's see. Okay, nicely packed, indeed this is the, uh, it is, yeah, it is, a nice thin uh, cable for the um, network cable, and this is the CDU, so let's unpack it. Cable, the screws and fasteners, and let's open the main thing. This looks nice. Okay, this is a little bit different from the normal CDU. This is CDU 737 Pro. This is uh, the other one and uh, the Pro one. And you can see this is different. Normally you have to uh, do it like this to, to turn to do uh, the, the brightness up and down. Okay, this feels a little bit different than the normal one, but let's see, okay. Look at the back, only two um, connectors here. This is the uh, network connector, this is the power connector. Okay, let's fire the thing up. Okay, we built this uh, CDU Pro from CP Flight. Uh, we built it uh, in our simulator. We had some difficulties to, uh, to connect to ProSim because you have to have, when you have uh, two CDUs, you have to have two, uh, two uh, 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 times the ProSim CDU display.exe running, otherwise it won't run. Um, I will show you some things, let's put with the dot key, it turns on and that's quite interesting it's a raspberry inside as you can see it's running some scripts now it's all looking good and as you can see cp flight 
Okay, um, first, what I want to show you is the menu of the CDU itself, because it's standalone, you have to fill everything in here. I hope you can see this okay. Let's okay. Um, as you can see, there are some, uh, some things here. Uh, you can use the previous page or next page to go to the next menu. It's now in the DHCP mode, it's still on yes. IP address you cannot change. Um, and, uh, you have to fill the 118 in your um, ProSIM software, then goes to port number, normally 6000, leave it that way. CDU site, CP, uh, captain or first officer. Screen saver, we don't want, uh, you want it always on. And you can change the font index to another font if you want. Uh, with execute, it reboots in 5 seconds, 4 seconds, 3 seconds, 2 seconds. Let's see. It starts again with the probably the Raspberry logo. Yes, here they are. Running the script again. Okay. And here you have the FMC. Let's load the FMC. See, we are at um, LGAV is Athens in uh, Greece, and we go and have a flight to Amsterdam, which is already loaded in uh, Simbrief. And I will show you. There's a very nice way to use the A cars uh, to uh, fill this uh, FMC. Okay, start with FMC. Like that, and we go to position in it. Um, last position. It's all correct. Let's go to root. And this is new for me. Um, it's new in, in ProSim. Uh, flight plan request. Very, very handy. Let's fill in. Okay. Put in the volume. Flight plan requests. Wait a few seconds. And it's ready. It's loaded. And you can load it. And here you can see, let's clear this, load. And you can activate it, but we have to have the departure arrival. Let's say you go from 03 right and take this departure. And same for the arrival. Let's fill it in. Okay, I like this one. And maybe that one. Root. And now we can activate it, press execute, and it's filled in. Very, very easy. As you can see in the legs, there's a discontinuity here. Everything filled in. It's very convenient. Okay, FMC. Performance we just did. I will show you later how the, you can also uh, from the the pro from, from the, the, the sim brief you can also have a performance in it request let's do that wait for the ding dong and there it is load execute and everything is filled in except except for a few other things next page we will show you. Okay, that's all correct. And one limit, it's 15 degrees outside. Let's confirm that. Then for takeoff, let's say a five flaps takeoff, 20.8. According to the load sheet, it's a center of gravity. That's quite high. Okay, QRH on. Let's 
And what's also very convenient is the um, fuel is loaded with this. And the takeoff speeds are filled in. And we're on our way. You can go on our way. Very nice and very convenient from ProSim and it's a very nice CDU from, um, from CP Flight. Okay, thank you for your attention and we're going to fly to Amsterdam.